Dylan and I went to the entirely wrong gas station to meet these dudes up for the ride today and uh, yeah we feel pretty dumb so we're gonna we're gonna bust up in the actual <laughs> racetrack we're supposed to be at and if this isn't the one I'm cutting it quits and we're going home game time nobody invited him <laughs> <laughs> you wanna go? Hop on back, baby. <laughs> All right, we're out here with Dust for the Wind. My boy Rhett Moto, an up-and-coming famous moto vlogger on his Live Fast Clutch. What is that thing? The R6 that he won? Oh, oh, we got the cool boys here. <laughs> what? Oh God! I don't know. This thing will pick me the f up. I'm scared of it. I gotta lean forward. Oh, f I saw this to the line. You want to go to the line? Oh god. <laughs> You'll probably beat me. I don't know. This thing will pick me the f up. Yeah. <laughs> He's going to whoop my ass in that book. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> I was looking away. All right, we gotta do it again. I freaking beat that ass. I mean, it's an R6, so he would have freaking <laughs> any further, and he would have just blasted me. But still, <laughs> I won't. So apparently, after the race, they said that he was looking right when the light went green or something. I don't know. So, but I don't. Hey, he told me when the light's green, race to the next light, and I whipped it. Ain't my fault. He granny shifted. Okay, so this helmet doesn't have any type of a wind skirt or what do you call it? Like a chin curtain? Something like that? I don't know. Oh, the water from his tailpipes is hitting me. Oh, dude. Um, but, uh, so yeah, it, this helmet doesn't have any type of, I think it's called a chin curtain. What blocks um, air from going under your chin and stuff like that. But I do have a beard growing, so I wonder if my beard could act as a dead cat. Mm -mm. Did you ever think about that? You don't want to buy anything like a chin curtain or a dead cat? Grow a beard! Simple as that. Damn, what the fuck? <laughs> Shit. This thing just snapped. Dude, what the f I got this. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, the little uh it's gonna be a little bit colder. Yeah. Embrace. Embrace the suck. Both, both sides. All right. We stopped in Rep Moto. Apparently, this chick was like, "Can I borrow your bike for a second? <laughs> so she wants a picture on his bike. I guess. You think she's insta famous? She's like, I need a cool thrift, like crazy picture. I need my girls to think I'm freaking wild. Hashtag sassy as fuck. I really want to cock block him, but I don't. That would be rude. That would be rude. What if Rent Motor was like, hey, come here. <laughs> I need a picture. <laughs> to a random girl. What the f*** is going on right now? <laughs> this woman is ruining me eating barbecue right now. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me right now. She's looking for the best angle. <laughs> 
This dude over here is like, what in the hell? <laughs> this is the longest can you subscribe to my channel talk I've ever seen in my life. If she doesn't subscribe to his YouTube channel, I'm gonna be salty. Oh, I smell some green eggs and ham. What you know about green eggs and ham? What you know about green eggs and ham? So apparently this Harley right here is $25,000. I don't know. <laughs> that is more than my freaking Mustang. That's insane. I mean, I get, it's a vehicle and it's got all of its bells and whistles and all that, but a motorcycle for more than my Mustang? Well, that's Harley for you. You pay more for the price tag. But I will admit, that bike is pretty damn sexy. Holy shit! Pretty damn sexy for a, uh, for a Harley. It's kind of like a dark maroon, almost purple color. It's not purple, but it's, it kind of gives that vibe. But everything else is uh, black or smoked out slash murdered out. <laughs> oh, look at this. Ah, uh, he had a ginger beer. Yes, this Harley is more than that Mustang right there. Not crazy. That's just, that's just so wild to me that any bike could be more than 25 that Obviously, there's going to be some bikes that are like, you know, what is it, the H2? The H2 is like, oh shit, I don't even, that's way up there also. That's expensive. But you're getting a pretty damn crazy bike. For $25, I swear to God, this Harley right here better be able to like suck in your farts after you toot. It better be that high quality. Like it's got like a little pee nozzle that suctions right to your wiener so if you gotta pee on a trip, it just goes right out the bottom. Something like that for $25,000. For a butt massager in the back of that thing. What, what else do you think this thing should have for $25,000, guys? Leave some of your ideas in the comment section below. I want to know what do you think a Harley should have on it. Something crazy, smart, whatever you think. For $25,000. You know what I want? Heated seats. Do you think that thing has heated seats on it? Oh, bet you that guy doesn't have heated seats. What's up, dude? Oh, that was a fucking cop. Oh, okay. That was a cop. And he waved. I freaking love it. I hope he doesn't come behind us because <laughs> my tag is expired. If y'all don't say anything, I won't. Oh, is this the place right here? That doesn't look like it. Where the hell are we going? Ooh, is it up here? That looks like tractor. That's a tractor supply. No, that's not a barbecue shop. Unless they accidentally got a little bit of cow on the plow. <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding. I am not gonna lie, I have never been in this town. I don't know where the hell we are right now. Ooh, I can smell the barbecue though. Oh, there it is. It's Cole Hawley's. That's Cole Hawley's bike. Huh? Yeah. I was like, what the f Race? Race? Damn. Oh, I beat him by a shit ton. Oops. <laughs> he messed something up. I heard him. Right when we hit it, I heard him. <laughs> well, that's two races one today for I'm Souls. We got I'm Souls 2. I guess everybody else zero. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, he does have a WR250, so. I mean, it's a four, it's a DRZ 450. What do you think you're gonna do? He thought he was gonna beat me. I don't think so. <laughs> Obviously, any of these bigger bikes besides the WR 250 would whoop my ass. Like right now, 52 miles per hour, they're gonna just take me. They're gonna take my virginity and stomp it to the ground. Now nah, they're just gonna destroy me. But I mean, this thing is a powerhouse at low RPMs. 
you know, like from a dig and all that kind of stuff, or from, you know, maybe from 10 miles per hour, this thing whips it. And I haven't even done anything like the, um, what's it called mods? The uh, two, two or three by three? I think it's called the, uh, the DRZ 400 SM three by three mod and the jetted mod. I think once you do those things, this thing has like crazy power. It might not give it like a whole shitload of power, but it does, it just, it makes this thing perform so much better. Now we're just riding on some beautiful twisties out here. I don't do it much because my uh, Yamaha Bolt back in the day was such, like, the clearance was so horrible that I never, like, I never, ever, ever had confidence to hit corners and stuff like that. So I hated that. But now that I have the Supermoto, I can hit corners 10 times easier. So this is so much fun. All with my boys, like I said, does for the win. Rhett Moto, a couple new guys. This is actually Cole Hawley's bike right here. I don't know if y'all know that, but that's his new bike. Um, this dude bought it from him. So awesome shit. We're going to have some fun out here, but I think that my GoPro is about to die. It's dying on me. So what we're going to do is go ahead and tell you guys goodbye right now. So this concludes the video. Thank you guys for all your support. Please don't forget to comment, like the video if you love it, and subscribe if you can't wait to see more of the channel. So until next time, peace out everybody. Seat, man, so.